Yeah, because what the reservoir engineer is doing, he looks to the ratio of surface area, artificial lake area, and volume. Yeah. And you can't mow trees, yeah. and you plant a million seven hundred grass, and the water level is increasing in Lake Nevers. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> if you take the water from Lake Navasha and you irrigate, the EC of the water will decrease. Meaning, if that is true, the more greenhouses you put here, the higher the lake goes. But it makes a, a large difference whether you look at a, a basin which goes into the Indian Ocean, which is just across the hill there. If you go to the top, all the water will flow as the was in Geo catchment. One time you said that it was uh, better to draw water out of Naivasha and then to make the water uh, uh, more, more, more dilute and therefore to be better water. Is that correct? Absolutely wrong. No. The cucumbers can only be used to bind the river banks to avoid soil erosion. But basically, if, if the more you irrigate, if you irrigate from the Malewa River, the EC, the total dissolved solids in Lake Navasha will increase. Yes. Mm -hmm. If you take the water from Lake Navasha uh -huh. and you irrigate, the EC of the water will decrease. The river is drier less than the bottom of the yeah. But the it's issue of catchment, no, mm -hmm. can't I can't agree. Yeah, that is concentrated. You take more of the salt and it brings less of the salt. How do you think ecologically? Yes. What is the impact? Because these guys are used it to use it to this salinity. Yeah, yeah. If you lower it, who are you? We are removing. Now you're going to change it. And when the population changes, even the food will be affected. Yeah, because it will affect all the food chain. Exactly. And then you, we are harvesting the top guys, but they are depending on the lower guys. We just want the ecological transition. <laughs> Yeah. Which Hapa was trying to do? Yeah, we want the ecological bit of it. And this <laughs> and is another and discussion. Go and tell WWF to change the objective. Plant more grass, cut more trees. He didn't say that. Yes. That is what he said. Yeah. For the water to to increase. Yeah. 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 The role of uh, forest. Can it Because it creates a lot of pressure. cannot be compared. It is very high. It is the pressure belt which attracts this. Now, I think it's how you're going to get in This one helps to reduce only evaporation. But how about the river banks? Yes. How about the river which we want to come. I'm not satisfied with that. Okay. The environment mm. engineer. Yeah. yeah, because now we are, we are talking about uh, water catchment. And this guy consume more water supply. So the more you consume water supply, the more you generate to water. So it means that we don't see another side of where we can manage the water at the catchment area. Yeah. I don't buy that story. And that's why, why? Because trees are important, they attract rain. Yeah. The argument was that uh, trees are big consumers of water, especially the young trees. They have deep rooting systems. So what he was trying to say was that the grass is very good as far as water conservation is concerned, especially the kikuyu grass which has been used all over the world. Because from the life cycle, what is mm. is that we personally I believe it was by ration that the water goes out and then it comes back. Well, but I think it's still debatable because my colleagues are just telling me here that when you have the forest, there is the pressure belts, two of them are created. But we are all speaking, all of us. Is yes, we will be contributing. Because nobody knows it here. But what I need is that the transmission from trees. The air is light, isn't it? Yeah. It creates a pressure belt on the low pressure belt on the canopy. Mm. Uh -huh. And the, we know air moves from which belt to which belt. High, con high pressure to low pressure. Now it means it will move towards you where you have good trees. skin of trees. So I disagree. Most of us are here, ecologists. Yeah.
but uh, it's well to track the wind. You can't isolate it. Then the traffic we can work without the, the other one. It goes where so the water flows to where it goes. But if only we rely on the, the facts. Of the we, but the issue of telling you that uh, you can cut where, all the trees and replace with water, with grass, mm. to clear grass, and you have better roads so in terms of water management. So the tracking so and the, the, the rollover tree, when it rains, it catches water, and when it rains, the water falls on the tree and drifts down to the roots of the tree. And that it goes straight into the soil and that becomes the seepage. And that is where our springs are formed. And then you have our